this. This is Nikki. I hope that everybody is having a wonderful day. Uh, Taurus, you got some excellent energy out here on this board. This should make some of you guys very happy. I got reconciliation. I got reunion. I got second chance. I got back together, okay? I got I miss you, boo, all right? I got wedding, y'all, okay? I got marriage. I got forever. I got um, the one, okay? The one, union. And I got healing old wounds, all right? Look, you show right in the, up in the middle of the energy with this hierophant towards this is you, okay? This is marriage, institutions, the traditional speaking of the word. Now, there has some, been something that went on, okay? And this is the reason why I have healing old wounds. Because somebody, one of you or somebody in your energy, um, you know, was in despair at one point in time, full of anxiety, nightmares, regret, guilt. Somebody felt regret. Somebody felt guilt. Somebody felt remorse. Somebody felt a burden. There was a conversations and conversations that did not take place because either somebody was blocked or just simply not on the same page with one another. Okay. This caused a whole lot of disappointment and a lot of mental anguish. Okay. Which it feels like somebody wasn't willing to let this go. Okay. It was like, I'm not sitting up in this nine of swords. All right. Because whoever this person is that you're reconciling with, whoever this person is, that this wedding may take place with this reunion, this second chance, this I'm back together, this person who you miss or did miss this marriage, this forever, this person who you feel is the one, this union, um, this person also was very supportive. You guys was in some type of collaboration together. This is more than just love, okay? This is also three of pentacles, y'all. This is something that you guys planned. You guys got um, a lot of background as far as business skills together, <clears throat> goals, commitment. You guys worked well as a team. You networked, okay? This was something more than just a love. This was also being on the same page as far as business is concerned. You may even have... Um, this may be a co-worker. This may be somebody who you have done business with. This may be um, somebody who you have um, some type of experience in, mm -hmm. you know, as far as the business that you're in or the, you know, the business that they're in. Love you too, guys. So that's what I got for you. And so let's go ahead and clarify this energy. This energy does not look bad at all to me. I do see where somebody was in a, in a messed up, you know, hey, somebody, you know, you know, was sitting up here laying in the bed, you know, tripping and depressed, you know, looking at somebody's social media at one point in the game. But I mean, I got marriage twice here on this board and I got reconciliation. So either you done already reconciled, somebody's working on healing old wounds, or you will be reconciling soon. And it says marriage here, okay? It says wedding, okay? So that's forever. That's the one. And, you know, that's a union. So, you know, I'm you know, I'm happy for you, Taurus, if this is the case, okay, for some of you. Listen, um, if you guys, uh, first of all, let me thank my new subscribers, you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. Y'all know I love y'all. I love my day ones. I really appreciate you guys, all of your support, your love, your emails, your comments. Um, if you guys have not subscribed to the channel, Please accept my invitation to subscribe. There are so many things that's going on right now. There's, you know, I'm giving away, I announce my winners once a month. Free reads are included in that. Um, crystals, crystal bracelets, tarot cards, oracle cards um, is all included in that, okay? Um, there is another way to get a free read, and that is for every 100 new subscribers. Um, somebody will get a free. And you guys, we are almost there, okay? We we only like 50 away, okay? Really, for real. So um, somebody will be getting a free read, okay? I will be announcing my new my winners uh, once a month, and that is at the beginning of the month, okay? So uh, with that being said, please like, share, and subscribe, you guys. I would love to have you. Cross Watcher Energy can and will get involved in Cross Watchers. You are very welcome here on this channel as well. Please like, share, and subscribe, okay? I'd love to have you too. Holy Spirit. What's going on, Lord? Okay. Could be confirmation. Somebody might be willing to ask somebody to marry him. It's like, okay, should I? You know what I'm saying? That's, that's what I'm feeling too, okay? Yeah, somebody see some tour. Virgo Taurus. Capricorn is definitely on the scene here. Somebody finding out information about somebody. Probably during this nine of, sword, nine of Swords situation, okay? There you go. I see Virgo Taurus Capricorn. You might be dealing with a Virgo Taurus Capricorn. It's coming up a lot in the middle of the deck, guys. Somebody was going to sit back and guard it at one particular time. Either you put somebody in that feeling or somebody put you in that feeling, okay? Jail hospital is here, okay? But then nevertheless, somebody is still bringing love. 
Okay, they're bringing an offer of love. They're willing to do whatever the hell they need to do with this here magician, all right? Okay, so I mean, even lying and manipulating to have this relationship, okay? But whatever, okay? They're willing to do whatever to have you back, okay? They don't like the fact that somebody cut somebody's energy off here. This is the reason why you got reconciliation because somebody put cut somebody's energy off here with this King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You got a Virgo toward Capricorn to keep on popping up. All right. Somebody is dealing with a Virgo toward Capricorn. This is that simple. I see it too many times. Somebody wants something to go in the right direction with this here love. And it will because here go your reconciliation, okay? Your ace of cups, all right? So let's get busy. All right, Holy Spirit, tell me about this. This reconciled to Taurus because, you know, there's somebody, somebody love here, okay? Yeah, somebody's been patient, okay? Somebody's even moving different, okay? Maybe their attitude has changed, okay? But definitely moving different and having patience when it comes down to this reconciliation, all right? Yeah, you got new, you, you know, you got the star here, y'all. This is new, this is killing, you know, this is opportunity, all right? This is somebody see somebody as a star, okay? This is, I want you back. I want to heal this relationship. I'm willing to wait it out. I'm willing to have the patience that I need in order to have this new beginning in this relationship, okay? And they're willing to do whatever the hell it is that they need to do, too. That's another thing, Okay? A good energy, okay? Because they tired of fighting. They don't want to fight. Nobody, somebody doesn't want to fight here anymore, okay? They don't like it. It hurts them. It puts them in a nine of swords to do this fighting, okay? Okay, we're talking about an Aries or a Taurus. So this could be you or you're dealing with an Aries or a Taurus, okay? We got Sagittarius on the board. We got Aquarius on the board. I have seen Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn probably about five times as I was shuffling today. I got Aries and Taurus on the board. Tell me about this three. Uh, tell me about this wedding. Holy Spirit, what, what, what's going on? This is the one. Somebody wanna somebody wanna get married here. Somebody is sexy, somebody is vivacious, somebody is sassy, somebody has somebody's unique, okay? Whoever this person is, and this person also has like a a shadow side, okay? This person could be like into you know a different kind of spirituality, all right? This person could be a witch too, okay? You got Virgo on the board here, okay? Holy Spirit, give me more. About this wedding, with this person is the one person. Yeah, here we go with this Virgo towards Capricorn again. So Virgo towards Capricorn, y'all. We got heavy Virgo. Somebody's very, somebody is very attracted to somebody here. I see a pregnancy, okay? It could be somebody's pregnant. It could be a pregnancy up around you. Somebody could have possibly just had. A Virgo towards Capricorn is the one pulled their energy back, you guys. This is the reason why our reconciliation is happening. That could be you. Or it could be them. Y'all going to have this puzzle pieces, y'all. Okay? But somebody is working very hard in order for this energy to come back, okay? Like I said, they, they working hard on healing these wounds, Okay? Yeah, and it got everything to do with this fighting. It got everything to do with this not being on the same page, okay? It could have been another individual or other individuals in your relationship as well, okay? But this person, somebody is bringing them an offer, period. It is slow, but it's coming, okay? Tell me about this Three of Pentacles, Holy Spirit, please. This is networking. This is supporting one another, okay? Willpower, drive, success, victory, okay? You guys have victory, willpower, success when it comes down to supporting each other and collaborations. You guys do well with planning and goals. There's some toxicity here, all right? What is the toxicity, Holy Spirit? When it comes, ooh, see how that's trying to jump out of me, y'all? I'll do that. I feel my cards, y'all. I'm clear the intent, okay? Give me this en enemy. Because this, this is the reason why somebody is, is healing some old wounds. Somebody was either younger than somebody here, moved too fast with some type of rapid fire planning, okay? And really fucked something up here, okay? This is the reason why somebody needs a second chance, okay? Sex was good. They wanted a new beginning when it came down to this support, this partnership. Maybe they thought they was learning somebody and didn't because guess what? Somebody hit a tower here, okay? 
something sudden came to light, okay? So regarding this individual, all right, who you or them supported one another, collaborated one another, had maybe similar backgrounds in work, or just was an excellent team member. Somebody with this chariot was on board, okay? There was some toxicity that came up. Somebody is a little bit younger than here. Um, pay for wands happens to have a bad reputation of planning shit and not thinking, okay? Sex came into play. However, there was a new beginning that was supposed to happen, but something happened between here because the tower got hit, okay? And that is sudden information coming to light, okay? Sudden shocking information. This is the reason why reconciliation is the first thing that's on the on the board here. And that's because whatever this tower, this shocking information came out, somebody completely pulled back their energy. They left the situation alone, okay? Somebody was being either a hoe or somebody was wanting a serious ass new beginning, okay? Somebody felt like this person was good news to them and good for them, all right? And sex was good. This is, person is abundant, okay? Somebody here is very abundant, and they were single at the time, okay? This is Nine of Pentacles. Give me one more, and then we're going to move on to this Hierophant, okay? Somebody seen somebody as a very bright opportunity. Somebody seen this single, abundant person as a very bright opportunity. What this um, toxic behavior... Give me the enemy. What is this? Give me more on this. The toxic behavior was the tower too, uh, moving too fast. Whatever happened, wounded, set back, wounded, and put this part... Set this person back, wounded this person, and put them on guard, and fucked what they trust, okay? Is what happened, all right? That's what happened. That's what this 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 negative energy is, okay? This could have been lying. This could have been, you know, tricking somebody. Yeah, okay? And whoever this is, this person is not from where you're from. This person got a child from a distance. This person had to make a change. They relocated. They was reluctant to change different backgrounds possibly baby mama baby daddy out of distance okay something to that degree but however the truth still was not communicated okay you see them swords face down give me um the higher friend holy spirit so y'all got a pass all right G give me more what is this higher friend? this is your marriage here okay yeah, somebody betrayed this, okay? This is backstabbing, all right? This, somebody betrayed the trust of somebody here. Somebody hurt somebody here, okay? So whatever this reconciliation is and this marriage forever the one person, okay? This person is betrayed. This person got ten of swords. This is deep anguish, okay? This is pain right here, okay? This is the reason why you got the nine of swords next to this. And this is the reason why you got a second chance around. And this is the reason why, you know, there's healing old wounds here because this you're not. Yeah, this was an ex situation or a very familiar situation. Somebody um, had cherished memories. Somebody couldn't let the past go when the breakup happened, okay? Holy Spirit, tell me more about the Hierophant. But then you got the Hierophant again. So that means that there was a second chance around, okay? So you either got married to this person or you're going to get married to this person or this person just has a higher commitment, okay? And there go your second chance, and there go your healing all wounds. And the, uh, wounds is some serious ass wounds because a, a swords, that's a ten of swords, okay? That's that's the okay. Now we got the three of swords. So not only did somebody betray it, hurt somebody with deep anguish, somebody also has somebody in a third damn party, okay? Yeah, and this person who you with, this shit is all is wound. This is the reason why this is right here. It's saying all healing all wounds. This person's trying to heal, okay? It is you or somebody else, okay? Trying to. Holy Spirit, tell me more about this. What, what's going on? Yeah, and they feel a loss. You or somebody else feels a loss, okay? Somebody is somebody is sad to either have hurt somebody or somebody is sad that they got hurt. One or the other. And they got everything to do with the same person because this is the three of So whoever this person is that you supported, was supportive in collaboration with, you know, had wonderful goals, you know, wanted to experience, experiment in commitment, teamwork. This is the person that is sad. This is the person that was in the Five of Cups. This is the person who went through the Ten of Swords, and this is the person who went through the Three of Swords, okay? A Ten of Swords meaning backstabbing, betrayed, left for dead, and third party, okay? We got Leo on the board, okay? Somebody is trying to have some strength here. Somebody was disloyal or somebody was trying to have some strength to do something here. Holy Spirit, tell me, what is this? Yeah, somebody has some strength to build walls is what happened. So if somebody walked away from this at one particular time, 
they had a lot of strength to do it, okay? They did not appreciate the disloyalty, okay? The trust is still not here. They've already built the wall, okay? Yeah. They love. It's love here, okay? But it's just the type of love that can be detached, okay? We got courthouse, okay? So, look, with, the, with this king of cups and this courthouse, this could very well mean wedding, okay? It could be karma for what somebody has done, all right? Some type of legal issues, okay? But we don't know because we got the moon card here. Somebody's hiding something when it comes down to this marriage or when it's coming down to whatever's going on in the courthouse. Something is not known. Somebody's about to take a risk, okay? Somebody wants somebody. They're taking a risk. Something's not known, okay, when it comes down to this courthouse. Or, or you might get married in the courthouse. That could be it too, okay? But the person who's in this nine of swords, this person who, well, you know, actually both, now I got both y'all in the nine of swords, okay? Listen, both of y'all, it's it like this. One person felt terror, anxiety, nightmares, insomnia, burden, remorse, disappointment, mental anguish. The other person feels remorse, regret, guilt, um, distress, and some type of insomnia, anxiety, and terror, okay? So you got two people with the same energy right here, okay? The perpetrator and the person that's hurt, all right? Give me more, Holy Spirit. What's going on? Yeah, there's love here, though. See, that's the thing. And you got a counterpart right here. You got the king and the queen of cups, okay? So that's, you know, listen, it's love here, okay? Holy Spirit, what, what is this queen of cups? What is she doing? Somebody is, I know somebody guarded. I, I already know this. Yeah, see, something's come to an end. Somebody is like, fuck this, okay? Somebody like, something is coming to an end. Now, is the relationship could come to an end? I don't think so. But it's some type of behavior. The damn show is coming to an end, okay? It with one of these individuals. It's just that simple, all right? It's almost like you get right or this shit ain't, it ain't gonna happen, period. They want to talk. Somebody want to talk about this, okay? Somebody wants to heal all wounds. They want to eat the wands. They want to pull up. They want to talk about this this, this pain, all right? They want it to go to, away because got you guys got the lovers. Tell me more about it, Holy Spirit. It's a bond. It's a bond that was distrusted. It would go with that Virgo towards Capricorn. Holy Spirit, tell me what's, what is she doing? Love, planting seeds for a better and brighter future. Okay. Baby. I love you too, baby. Mm -hmm, baby. <laughs> planting seeds for a better and brighter future, y'all. See, somebody's forgiving somebody here. All right. But I'm gonna tell you something. Somebody's forgiving somebody here, but you they got King of Swords in their energy, all right? So uh they're forgiving somebody. The wounds are being healed, okay. But there is somebody that is like, you You fuck up. One more mother, you only got one time, okay? It's like that. And maybe that's the reason why this wedding is here. Because it's like, let me hurry up and lock this motherfucker down. That's the energy of it, okay? Yeah, see with this Knight of Swords? Yeah. Because this motherfucker ain't playing with me no more. That's what this shit is right here. The Leo Sagittarius Aries somewhere in this energy, you guys. The cause is not a swords. What is she doing? Yeah, this could have been a third party, okay? Somewhere in y'all energy. Give me more Holy Spirit. King of Swords is like, I'm not dealing with this bullshit. It's just that simple. Look, didn't I just say that? King of Swords like, I'm not dealing with this bullshit. You ain't got no more time. You see this? This is the five of coins. This is your ass is going to be left out in the cold. It's just that simple. Fuck with it if you want to. That's that's basically what that energy is. Now, I don't know who, who uh, Taurus, but what I can tell you is that you do have healing old wounds. You do have reconciliation. You do got reunion. You do got second chance. You do got being back together with somebody and the fact that somebody misses somebody, okay? You also have wedding here marriage forever you know the one in union and healing old wounds but i'm telling you right now this feels very fragile to me okay this feels like yes okay there is a second chance that's being given 
but you don't have no more times, okay? It, like, you just don't. This is, it's like, this is it, okay? This is the last and the final chance. That's what it feels like, okay? So, Taurus, if this is you and this is somebody who you love um, and you the one that fucked up, you know, step lightly, boo. Step lightly, okay? Um, if this is somebody else and it's you that fucked up with this here Taurus, this Taurus is willing to deal with you, okay? But you need to understand the asses is watching you. And guess what? They ain't got no problem with death coming to this here situation, okay? They don't. And not only do they not have no problem with death coming to the situation, they also don't have no problem with roof, ruthlessly cutting somebody's ass off and leaving somebody ass in the cold. It's like they, they're, they're letting you know, you know, if this is a cross watch or Taurus is saying, you ain't got no more chances. It's just that this is your last chance, period. So, you know, y'all, for what I, you know, look like it's love here to me, you know, but it look like it's a lot of fuck shit that went on too, okay? And somebody is definitely hurt, okay? And so it's going to take some time. Healing all wounds, healing. You know, that takes time, y'all. So, you know, it's a lot of stuff that happens in between, Taurus. So, you know, this is what I got for you. And I hope that this was able to put some type of pieces together for you guys. Remember, this is puzzle pieces, okay? Um, Take what resonates, leave what don't, you know. But hopefully I was able to shed some type of light. And I love you guys dearly. You guys like, share, and subscribe.